morning ducklings. God, it's early. I don't even know what time it is. Anyways. Excuse me. It is the second, March 2nd. At least I think it is. Yeah. So I decided to record an early, early video so I can have a video for today. I'm tired still. I'm sorry. I wanted to make a video before the kids wake up. So I just have a thumbnail. I am making a movie re review of The Lodgers. And I don't really have much to say about it, so it's going to be a short review. Uh, so, I'm going to give it a 3 out of 5 star rating. And the reason why, it was kind of confusing on what the brother and sister's family ancestors did to end up with the curse. And... I couldn't understand that part. Like, what did they do? What did their ancestors do that was so wrong? That they ended up with a curse for, for, for every single year, every year, for the rest of their lives. And it passes down to the future family members. Um... It's a really weird movie. Um, I, I guess the family became, became incest. They, they, I don't know. It, it's gross. Because the brother started to have a thing for the sister. And it became a little like... It kind of controlled him. I guess, in a weird way, and it, it, it's not actually, it's just a really weird, weird movie, it's slow, it's a slow movie, like there's parts where it's boring, parts it's interesting, parts that, you know, makes you think, but for the length of the movie, I did not like. I know they have to make a movie long enough, but I mean, they could have made a short film. And I don't know, they kind of stretched the movie out a little bit to make it long, you know, to make it movie material, I guess, uh, lengthwise. But, I mean, it was an okay movie. It's one that you would have to watch to judge for yourself because everybody's different. But uh, there are some gory parts, some parts that goes, Ew, I don't want to see this. Ew, that's gross. Like, I don't want to see that. And then there's a part that makes you go, Oh, crap. Like, how did that get there? You know? Um, but uh, basically, this brother and sister... When midnight hits, they have to be in their beds, and they basically, like, have to have a set schedule a agreement thing with whatever it is that they deal with that is cursed. A curse? We'll call it a curse. So, the curse, basically, they have, an, they have to have an agreement with the curse, and they have to follow certain rules, and if they break the rules, then bad things start to happen. And one of the rules is they have to be in bed by midnight. And another rule is no outsiders are allowed in the home. And the daughter, the sister, she starts to go against those two rules. And that's when bad things start to happen. And the house that they live in is huge. It's beautiful. I mean, it kind of looks like it has to be condemned. But there's potential in a beautiful home. Um, oh, no, sorry. My screensaver kind of came on. But uh, that's all I can give you guys. I'm sorry it's not much. But uh, 
I hope that's enough for you guys to, you know, kind of be interested in it and go watch it. I mean, at times I wanted to turn it off because it wasn't really that interesting. But I gave it a chance. And, you know, at the end, I'm so confused about the ending. Uh, but I'm kind of, in, in another way, I'm kind of like not so confused. I know I'm kind of contradicting myself with the ending. Like, I was confusing about the ending. Like, okay, she's finally free. She can go and do whatever she wants because the curse is finally broken. And at the same time, I'm questioning, is it really broken? Is that curse really broken? So, sorry, that's all I can give you guys right now. It's been a while since I've watched it, and I'm just not recording a review because I have so many reviews that I have to record and upload. I'm sorry. So I'm going to be doing that throughout the day or something tonight, tomorrow, whatever. Ugh. So, that's all I have. It's a 3 out of 5 star rating. It was okay movie. I won't watch it again. Unless I'm in the mood. I have to be in the mood to watch it. It's one of those movies. That's just my my opinion, my taste. Um, so that is it. Thank you for watching this video. And if you're new, check out my other videos. Don't just judge me by this one video. Um, check out my other ones. I have a playlist, by the way, for all the little videos that I think are my best videos. Because not every single video I have is in the playlist. Just the best ones. At least the ones I think that are the best ones are in the playlist, which are more than half. Um, check out the links in the description box below. Subscribe to my channel if you'd like to. And as always, to live life to the fullest because I'm short, so am I. I love you guys. Bye, ducklings. Bye.